select class. Let me cut in real quick because I didn't explain anything. Is we are walking to the vet because the pups need to get their rabies vaccines. So the place that I'm walking to right now actually gives them their rabies shots for free. Uh, but it's 51 minutes, according to Google Maps, from my house. I've been walking for about 30 minutes. And I can't vlog as much because the dogs are pulling me. So, yeah. But still, it's a nice walk. They actually get to enjoy themselves and get to go out for a little longer than normal. So, yeah. So we just got back from the vet, huh, Nala? Her and Red had to get their rabies vaccines. It took us an hour to get there. And she cried a little bit when she got her rabies shot. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, kiddo. I know it hurts. I hate shots, too. Who's that? <coughs> Who is that? <coughs> All right, calm down. You guys aren't that tired enough. Calm down. I want to introduce you to all the, the deadheads, all the undead gaucho watchers. This is Red here. This is my buddy. He's my buddy. He's my pal. And that's Nala over there. She's the queen bee around here. She runs the show. This is Red, my little rascal. He's always getting into trouble, this guy. He's an escape artist. He's tried to escape like a million times. Come on, Red. Sit. Sit down. Show them how you know. Show them how you know how to sit. Sit. I said sit, fool. I said sit, fool. Have you ever been bitten by a dog? I've been bitten twice in my life by dogs. Now, dogs are beautiful. Any pet is beautiful. Um, nobody loves me like my dogs. My dogs will never turn their back on me. Your dog will probably never turn his back on you. That's why the saying goes, like, dog is a man's best friend. Because truly they are. No matter what, they still come at you and they wag their tail and they love to see you. And they love, they always want to cheer you up. Um, they know how you're feeling, you know, they, they love you. For real, it's unconditional. But I've been bitten twice by dogs. I felt the wrath of a dog. Um... <laughs> The two times I was bitten, now once was when I was a kid, I was small so I don't rem remember much, but it was a family member's dog that bit me, and it bit me in the face, right? Uh, luckily, it didn't scar me up, I still look pretty good, you know what I'm saying, but yeah, I was bit by a dog there, and I was bugging the dog, so the dog reacted. You know what I mean? I was a little kid, so it freaked me out. I had to go get a shot, because I think the dog maybe didn't have his rabies shot. But I don't remember. So that was the first time. The second time actually happened not too long ago. I went on vacation with my girlfriend, and we went to this beautiful place here in Argentina uh, called Tigre. Now, that's like a river. It's like a river here um, that you basically take a little boat from the city, from the, the, the centro or the, the central part of Tigre, and you go along the river, and there's different cabins and places to stay. Uh, it's a really cool place. I love it. So I used to go there all the time with my girlfriend. So once we went and we took the dogs. Now when we took the dogs, we didn't think that there was dogs, like loose dogs, out on the islands. Um, so we rented a cabin on an island, and there was loose dogs all around. Uh, and they run it. They're having the like, best time of their life. <laughs> There's like nothing. It's, there's no city. It's just these little islands for miles and water. So they like swim across the river. They chill in the sun. It's awesome. For a dog, it's probably awesome for any animal to live out there. So we're there and I have my two city dogs. The dogs that live in apartments and they're from the city. 
and they're out there having a blast too, but they don't know how to interact with these wild dogs, mostly my dog. They're both my dogs, Nala and Red, but Nala was my girlfriend's dog first. She lived with my girlfriend and Red lived with me. So Red always had a problem sort of with male dogs. At this time, he wasn't so hectic as he is now, but there was this giant dog walking around the islands. I mean, he looked like the dog from The Sandlot. Have you ever seen The Sandlot, the baseball kids movie? He was just like that dog. He was the biggest dog, one of the biggest dogs I've ever seen. Um, the other biggest dog I've ever seen was some girl had this dog named Dracula. It was a greyhound, and he was like huge, like that, and he had pointy ears. But this dog was huge. I mean, his foot, his paw was like my hand. And what happened? He came while I was hanging out with Red, and they fought. And Red and this dog started rolling around and fighting, and I had to like step in because this got this dog, this big dog was gonna kill my dog. So I step in, and when I reach in to separate them, the big dog bites me. Now here's the problem: we are on an island. Anybody? So we have to go off the island and go to the hospital to get a shot because we didn't know if the dog had rabies or what and um, my girlfriend studies medicine so she's telling me like we need to go do this and we need to get off this island and do that it was horrible I mean it's sort of like I was trying to have a romantic getaway and that sort of just you know killed the mood there but it's a you know a memory a sucky memory but I had to share it with her and my dogs and something that it's a good story to tell the dog didn't actually break too much flesh I don't have a scar or anything uh, it did bruise me and it did bite me, but um, I'm lucky he didn't rip my arm off because another dog could just rip out your muscle or something or, you know, totally do a lot of damage. But yeah, so those are the two times I've ever been bit by dogs. Have you ever been bitten by a dog? Let me know down in the comments. This in no way is to talk about negative things about dogs. Dogs are like people. They're like people. They have their own emotions, their feelings, their problems, you know? So I'm not mad at the dog that bit me, any of the dogs that bit me. Have you ever had an experience like that? Leave down in the comments, you know, your experience. I would love to hear it, and I'd love to, you know, hear from you, all my deadheads out there. You, 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 watching. Um, yeah, so... What we do here is go back, 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 back.